Okay, here we go. It's so crazy that he won this tournament with like his two week old Zora. Really? Jesus Christ. He was just juggling. That was just like, that was just textbook good player stuff. <laughs> He's just juggling him, and then Shutan thought he could get away, just gets him with back air. Yeah, that was nice. It was a good call out from Shutan. That was so much damage. I just looked like he got hit. He got hit with up smash once. Once that forty six. Oh, yeah. Zachary trying to hit him with like landing nair fair enough to a kill move. He, no, he's not dead. I think he could have killed him with like strong forward tilt though. Up throw. Not gonna kill. Barely doesn't. That should kill though. Yeah. I wonder if Shutan was DI'ing that right, because I feel like typically, up those that are like that, you actually want to DI towards the character, not away from them. But yeah, I don't know how it works with Sora, but I know with like Marth and uh, Roy's, that's how you want to DI it. That was actually really good evasiveness to avoid the Pikmin from Zachary. But I, I guess at the same time, Sora's air, air mobility is pretty good. Like, uh, his air acceleration is really good. So it's like really easy for him to just kind of weave, weave around. He saved him! He was not gonna come back. Zachary actually SD, actually SD'd with Sora and, and Shutan saved him. And he lost the sock first because of it. <laughs> Bad emo. Ooh. Try to go for down tilt up smash, but not at the right percent. He probably had to go for up air. He died from that? I feel like that was bad DI. Or maybe Shutan had to jump there and he, didn't, he just didn't do it. That was really good. So, something about Sora's Thunder. As soon as it hits the ground, there's like no hitbox. So you don't have to worry about it anymore. Like as soon as it touches the ground, there's there's no hitbox there. Yeah, that move looks more scary than it actually is. Yeah, the thunder hitbox isn't that active. So this is good awareness on Shutong's part to, to know that. Wow. Could he have forward smash there? Like instead of going for the forward tilt, I wonder. There's no way, okay. He did DI that bad too. He's dead here, yeah. Yeah, Shutan did DI that bad. If, if he died, that was the reason why. Cause I think he DI'd in when he should've DI'd out. Okay, the Pyramithra come out. Yeah, so this is one of Shutan's secondary characters. I wanna say Shutan, Shutan's probably the best Pyramithra in Japan. I don't know any anyone else who's using, who's using them. Like from the top Japanese players. I'm smashing and him with Pyro up air. No, oh, Pyro up tilt. Okay. That was good. Cover the air dodge with up air and then soft tilted. And again, going for down to up smash, or he should be going for up air. I'm assuming that. I mean. At this time, this this is like still pretty new for Zachary, so he probably just wasn't uh, used to the window of when to go for up air and when to go for up smash. Oh, he's dead, yeah. I was thinking after the whiff counter he could have forward smash, but I don't think he could. Or at the very least, uh, he died to dash attack. But at, at, or, at the, or at the very least, he'd have to do it like pretty preemptively. Wow, Kata mashing. I understand why he did it. I understand why Zachary went for this, but it just wasn't worth it at all. Like, yeah. 
That was one of those situations where Zachary's like, that's for sure going to hit. There's no way. I'm going to hit him before he hits me, 100%. And he just didn't. That was nice. That was really smart. But he dies a jab, one, two, three. Bro, how does Shutan lose? <laughs> what? He loses this. <laughs> I'm just looking, I'm like, damn, Zachary's getting worked right now. I'm like, oh, but he lo he loses. Okay, still alive, okay. I, I think in that spot, Zachary probably should have gone for up smash. Okay, he got him with the uh, the up air. I think uh, she turned the eye that wrong too. Small stage. Wow, that was nice. Hold on, I I, I need to get rid of this logo for a moment. As soon as he takes the stop, you can just see Zachary like he just does like a deep breath. He does a really deep breath here. He goes. He's like, all right, all right, I'm, I'm bringing this back. He's right there. He does it there. It's hard to see because of the because of the quality, but that was like the deep breath. He's like, that you do. You're like, I'm still in this. That was nice. Yeah, that, the story just has so many like mix-ups, like when he's in the air. Wow, he got that. <laughs> it's crazy because you can see how much like winning means with him. It's not even winning a tournament because he's won a tournament before. He's won big tournaments before. Like he just really wanted to win with Sora. I don't know if you guys saw his interview, but Sora was his most requested character in the game. He's like a super big uh, Kingdom Hearts fan, which I didn't I didn't know that until recently. Yeah, Zachary said he really wanted to just main Sora, so he really wants to make Sora work. Like, that's how much he he loves his character. I saw some of it. Like, I, I was watching the stream, so I saw some of it. But, yeah. I You guys want me to watch that? I could if I get enough people who want me to watch it. But for now, I'm just going to watch this BCA tw uh, 2021. And then uh, EP EP EPI. Damn. I'm surprised Shutan switched back to Olmar actually. I'm guessing he did it because he's like, oh, if he can reverse three stock me, I'm not gonna win with Pyramithra. Or maybe he just likes Stadium more with uh with Olmar. I feel like that's kind of like the huge benefit to Sora's counter. Although it's um, not as active as some other counters, it doesn't have that much end lag. So it's it's kind of hard, harder to punish compared to, you know, a, la a laggier counter. So you can kind of throw it out as Sora and then you just don't expect to be as heavily punished. Well, that was nice. You reversed the up there too. The Pikmin, uh, smash attack. Yeah, so right there. Oh, that's funny. So he hit Shutan, but he also clanked with the Olimar up smash because Pikmin and Olimar, they're kind of, they're treated differently. So it's not like, it's not like a traditional move where you can hit the opponent and then the animation stops. The Pikmin animation will still go through sometimes. That's what happened there. And, uh, Zachary was stuck in like the clank animation. And when you clank with like a purple Pikmin, or, le or at least in this case, he has like a long clank animation. So he's just like stuck there. I actually think if uh, Shutan didn't roll, he could have just punished him. Just backers him. Yeah. And there he is, popping off. 
And again, like, I feel like normally in this situation, Zachary wouldn't really pop off like that, or at least not in Japan. But because he's playing Sora and this, like, he just really wants to win with this character. I can't believe he, he like, got the reverse three sock in game four, by the way. That's still crazy. How's it going, guys? So I decided to just open up this random arena. I'm just going to sit here and chill and wait for someone to join, and then I'm just going to play them, because why not? I'm, I'm bored. Just waiting for anyone to join. Oh, wait. Why, why is, why is Leo joining my room, my arena? Does he have better things to do? Shouldn't he be like some tournament winning or something? All right, he, he ain't messing around. All right, we got Battlefield, okay. This is a really good stage for me, so this shouldn't be too bad. But here we go. Oh. Come on. Dude, okay, like, I'm not doing any of that, by the way. Like, I don't, I don't, I don't know why. Like, I just keep messing up with little things. It just... All right, I know, I know what I have to do. I know what I have to do. All right, I gotta bring out the big guns. I have to bring out the big guns. This has to be done. I'm gonna go in with the with the quick glitch shot of my flavor, the, the Falcon Smash. So, that's how we're doing. All right, bottoms up. All right. I'm not getting three stock this time. This time, this time is serious. This time I'm powered up. There we go. There we go. Yeah, let's go. Jesus Christ. Oh God. All right, all right. All right, all right. Well, I'm on the full stock. I'm on the full stock. Oh, let's go, I did it! Yes! Yes! And that is the power of Glitch. If you guys want in on this, all you have to do is go on GlitchInterview.com and use my code LarryLarry to get 25% off at checkout. There's also a starter kit that's only $15, comes with a shaker cup and seven different flavors. So if you're new to Glitch, I would recommend trying that. So, Kome versus Zachary. I feel like we might see Counter come to play more when Kome's off stage compared to uh, Zachary's other matchups. Just because I feel like it, it's, it should be easy for Sora to just like jump off and counter Shulk's up B. At least at a higher percent. I don't think he's gonna like do it whenever he's off stage, but I think it's a, it's a possibility that we could see. Oh, I guess something else too is I feel like Shulk's probably gonna have like a pretty easy job edge guarding uh, Sora. That is not the bracket for this tournament, by the way. And there's the bear. That was such good timing. Even though he didn't get the kill, that was still really good. That's crazy. Was that a poke? They did that. I mean, it definitely didn't, but I wonder if it would have poked anyways. But yeah, that's what makes Sora so crazy, like, so scary. He has so many mix-ups when, he, when he's in the air, like, touching your shield. Ooh, he up smashed the wrong way. He probably should have gone for down smash there. Porto's gonna kill, wow. Oh, he's dead. I was gonna say, like, Conway's surviving for such a long time. I'm kind of surprised Zachary hasn't, um, like, closed down edge guard on him yet. He's gonna get, like, a down to up smash. <laughs> well, I feel like Zachary's gonna just down to up smash him or something. Oh, maybe? I'm yeah, still living. Wow, there's, like, almost. I mean, it's not gonna go to time, but look how much, look how much time's left. It was a long ass match. Oh yeah, caught him rolling in. Yeah, Shulk. I feel like Shulk gets a lot of really good kills like, uh, while cornering the opponent or knowing the opponent like wants to like try to go in. He's dead, yeah. Komei running off with Smash Art made Zachary panic and he just directional air dodge when he's like super low. <laughs> I 
Man, it's definitely one of those situations where Komi just was not expecting to get hit. Because he was drifting in, he died wrong. And died super early. Yeah. I like it from Zachary. Because if he up B, Komei was, was, was going to be ready to, to punish it. Like in this matchup, I, I don't think uh, Sora can up B low against Shulk. It's just going to be way too easy for Shulk to be in Smash or and just raw ferret or dare it. That had to have been a miss input, and wow. I feel like in this spot, instead of doing down tilt up air, he should have up smashed. I feel like he would have, he would have he would have been able to kill him. Also, I don't know what his, what Zachary's opinion on Sora is. <laughs> Can you imagine? He says, "Oh, Sora's low tier, dude." <laughs> After winning this tournament, like Sora sucks. Oh yeah, up air with the uh, that was a shield poke from up with the the up air. Yeah, that seems really consistent to do actually in that spot, or at least against uh, like characters that are, that are around Shulk's height. I'm waiting for Zachary to do a down to up smash. He's looking for it too. He's definitely looking for the confirm. That was so good. That was so good. So, in case you guys don't know what happened here, Komei used the invulnerability frames that Shulk gets for activating his Monado art and just punished him. In case you guys don't know, Shulk has 14 frames of invulnerability after activating the Monado art. So, Zachary tried to punish him here. He activates. Invulnerable, so, it, like, he just goes through it and then he just threw him. Yeah, that's probably one of the most ridiculous things Shulk has. And Shulk has a lot of ridiculous things, mind you. That in itself is pretty insane, because that's a lot of invulnerability. Ooh, he didn't die there. Oh, he's dead there. It's like I said before, if... If Soria is like forced up B in certain situations, I feel like it's just super free for uh, for Shulk to just run off an edge guard him. <laughs> wow, that killed. I mean, okay, that did like that did fifteen percent. Up tilt did more. I feel like eighteen, right? And I killed. I mean, that's not surprising. I feel like anyone can kill Wolf super early if they counter, if they counter side B. Can't kill him. Yeah, you can't kill him without Smash Art. <laughs> yeah, that was good. Wow, that was really good. I don't think that was in the two frame, was it? Oh no, that was a two frame. Wow, okay. That's crazy. Also, I want to point this out too. In this situation, I feel like Komi should have rolled away. Because him being. Him shooting the thunders, like, put him in, in that spot. Yeah, because he tried to jump away, but he couldn't. Because. I want to say. That, that was probably positive on S.H.I.E.L.D., like the thunder that Zachary did on him. Yeah, you just want to avoid thunder. It's actually, running into him is pretty viable, because like the thunder hitbox isn't that active. Feels like Zachary hard adapted to Komei. Oh my god. I'm actually surprised. Oh. I was gonna say I'm surprised Komi didn't get, didn't give him a roll or he didn't bite. He didn't do anything. He just held shield. If so, I still need to watch that. Damn. Wait. Oh my! That should have been so much damage. Like so much more damage because that already was a good amount of damage from Komi. But yeah, he even read that Zachary's gonna counter there.
Yeah, hit him with strong forward tilt. So that can hit below the stage. That can two frame, and it can kill. Man, off match look awful for Sora. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised. That are he's probably just not used to it because. I don't know how often, oh my god, that was nice. But I was gonna say, I don't know how often he plays, like, Fox. That was good. Yeah, so right there, Komei probably expected Zachary to chase him, but he's trying to drift away and Zachary just hit him with up smash. Zachary trying to do. Oh yeah, he definitely tried to bear. Had to be early. Ooh. Okay, yeah. Bro, that's like... He didn't want Barry there. And then he just like ran up and, and did it. Yeah, that's so much shield damage. That's... <laughs> like, the shield... His shield didn't even come out. His shield wasn't even out when it broke. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Zachary knew for sure that was gonna break, it, it seemed like. But yeah, Sora's down smash does a lot of shield damage. That move is actually crazy. It's like better K rule down smash. Because like, uh, Sora has invulnerability frames when he does it. And it breaks shields. That up here, man. That was also just really good too, because Komei was in smash art and stayed in it. Oh, that was a good drift. So right here, when Kami did the down air, Zachary drifted away to avoid getting hit by uh, the down air. If he had drifted in, then he would have gotten hit for sure. Like look, look, like look at this. He clearly would have gotten hit. But Zachary, being aware of that, just drifted back and then he grabbed the edge. I got it up here. Damn, he got him. Zachary popping off again with the reverse 3-0. Actually, wait, that hit high. That hit really high. Bro, what is that nonsense? He got hit by sparkles. And that sweet spotted. He got, he got killed by Disney Magic. That's what did Komei in, Disney Magic. That's where your Disney Plus money's going. It's going to that. It went straight to Di to Sora's up smash. <laughs> Zachary with the pop-off. Like, again, Zachary really wants to win with Sora, which is why he's popping off like as hard as he is. I'm kind of surprised uh, Shutan didn't start Pyramithra, but maybe... Yeah, I, I feel like that reverse three stock that Zachary did messed up. Even though it shouldn't have. Like, regardless, his, his uh, pyramid was doing really good. Do you understand why people underrate Sora so much? That's kind of how people are with, with especially, like, well, that's how people are in general, but especially DLC characters. People will either say they're really bad or they're broken. I feel like out of all the DLC, honestly, Fire Mithra is probably the only one where a lot of people were, were saying she was really good. Man, Zachary is just... It doesn't even feel like he's doing anything like super crazy with Sora. Well, yeah. It doesn't feel like he's doing anything super crazy with Sora. He's just... This feels like he's good player in him. Yeah. He charged it too. He made sure that that was gonna kill. See, look. Yeah, got the slight charge. Oh, he should have charged that. Or forward smashed. Yeah, 
can hold Fort Smash that long, yeah. I'd argue... He's, I think he's dead here. Yeah, I was gonna kill him. Oh my god. <laughs> he is just... He's just hitting them. Oh, he's dead. Good counter. I feel like Zachary could probably counter uh, Mithra's up B because their up B will hit below the ledge. Although I don't know if like the the counter attack will actually connect because it sometimes whiffs oh, connected there. <laughs> I feel like Shuton's trying to mash out of this advantage with. with with uh, Pyra. But he's like getting hit more. <laughs> Damn. That looked like it was bad beyond the up air too. So I don't know if that was like for sure gonna kill, but yeah, you got it, you got the you got it regardless. Flying with the up smash. I wonder if he could have dashed up smash and connected it. Oh, the up smash there. He definitely countered. I'm willing to bet money. Countered. He's just gonna come out in time. Yeah. <laughs> He was like, few frames off, it looked like. <laughs> you could hear the sound of the counter come out. Wait, what do you mean? Counter doesn't stop Mithra's side B for some reason? He went for the shield break. Actually, I don't think he went for the shield break there. He probably just anticipated him running in. I frames. Wow, wait, I think he got him like the frame that had to have been frame the frame like he was invulnerable. Like look at that, because he's blinking white there. I wanna say if he charges this he would have connected it. Right here. Yeah. Yeah, he had to charge it. He for sure would have gotten it. <laughs> yeah. That was nice, yeah. That dare, like, as high as Shutan did, it was pretty unsafe. Makes you wonder, maybe you try to auto cancel the dare and just didn't get the spacing for it. Oh, he still died. Dude, he lived for like 10 seconds. <laughs> I mean, I'm exaggerating, but still. I think Shuton was just going to keep doing it to rack up as much damage as he could, like the uh, drop up B. Yeah, he got the mirror. Yeah, he just, he was just off. He should have buffered, but he probably thought that Shuton was on a fastball or something. I actually can tell about using different wolf combo roots. Um, I feel like he has more tech chase opportunities. Like I've been doing a lot more uh, bear shine and then just intentionally not continuing the combo, like letting them lie on the platform and just com or common to nair or something else. 
Wow, that was a really good counter. <laughs> that was that was nuts. These counters. Zora's counter is so good. I feel like that's ha that, this has got to be like the happiest Zachary's been winning a tournament. Like just because he freaking loves that character Sora. If not the happiest, it's, this has to be like top three or something. Top three happiest tournament wins for him. 